If someone is on leave or has left the organization, certain employees with appropriate permissions can verify a procurement card transaction on behalf of other workers or delegate the task. We are still logged in under Trevin, who does not have the appropriate permissions to approve for others. If we search and select Verify Procurement Card Transactions for Worker, Trevin will receive an error from Workday saying that the task submitted is not authorized for his permission level. We are now logged in as an approver with permission to verify procurement card transactions for other workers. Under the Workday search bar, select Verify Procurement Card Transactions for Worker or type it in. This will take you to the Verify Procurement Card Transaction for Worker screen. Zoltan can verify procurement card transactions on behalf of Michael. So under Verification 4, search for the employee and select OK. Select the transactions and select OK. Now you can verify Michael's transactions as they were your own. Once Zoltan has finalized, she can select Submit and it will go to the appropriate approver and it will inform them that she did it on behalf of Michael. Approvers can also delegate their approval tasks. Going into the inbox, they can verify a transaction that requires their approval and select the three bar menu and under Actions Business Processes, select Delegate Task. Under the Delegate Task window, select Propose Delegates and select the employee that you would want to delegate the task to. And you can enter a comment so that they are aware of the reason for the delegation. They have now delegated the task to Zoltan. Workday will tell you the details of the process completed and who it was delegated to. Delegated approvers receive a notification in their inbox and they will be required to switch accounts to the delegated employee. Once there, they will have a delegation dashboard and they will go and see the inbox action required for the delegated activity. As you can see here, the delegated employee can now review the procurement card transaction and approve on their behalf. The details and process screen will let you know under process history who delegated for whom. The delegated approver can then switch back to their original account. If an approver will be out for a long period of time, they should identify a backup. In the Workday search bar, type My Delegations. Then go to Manage Delegations. Select the begin date and the end date. Then type in the name of the delegate. Select a task type under Start on my behalf. Click the search bar and search for P-Card verification or Verify Procurement Card Transactions. Under View Inbox Task on my behalf, select For Business Process. You want to select the Procurement Card Transaction Verification Event. Also select the Retain Access to Delegated Tasks in Inbox. You can then enter a comment.
and select Submit. You may receive alerts or errors depending on the type of request, but once completed, it will show that you have submitted it and you can view details of the request. Delegation requests may go through additional approval. For example, this delegation request requires Kelly Jones approval. Once approved, it will show as success event approved. Going back to the My Delegations page, you can review current task delegations, delegation history, delegated tasks, as well as the business processes that you are allowed to delegate.